Indonesian President Joko Widodo urged US President Joe Biden during a visit to the White House to do more to end atrocities in Gaza and help bring about a ceasefire. The Israel-Hamas war overshadowed the Oval Office talks, which had been meant to showcase an upgrade in ties as Washington tries to boost alliances against an increasingly assertive China. The US is Indonesia appeals to the US to do more to stop the atrocities in Gaza, Widodo, the leader of the world's most populous Muslim-majority nation, said as the two presidents met in front of a roaring fire. Ceasefire is a must for the sake of humanity, he added. The Indonesian president had said he would bring Biden a very strong message from a joint summit of Arab and Muslim leaders in Riyadh at the weekend which condemned Israel and called for a ceasefire. Widodo also said he would deliver a specific message from President Mahmoud Abbas of Palestine, who asked me to convey it to President Biden, regarding the war. U.S. officials had said Biden would in turn urge his Indonesian counterpart to take a larger role in resolving the Israel-Hamas conflict in the talks at the White House. Indonesia last week denied an allegation by Israel that a hospital built in Gaza using Indonesian charity funding sits atop a network of Hamas tunnels. The meeting had been aimed at showing unity ahead of Biden's summit with Chinese President Xi Jinping in San Francisco this week, with Washington trying to counter Beijing in the Asia-Pacific region.